This is my friend Adam. And ever since we were kids, Adam was always looking for love in all the wrong places. So Adam has been pressing me and pressing me to put him on a blind date. I had to think outside of the box. So we flew to the Big Apple to see if we could find his soulmate. But this is not like any other blind date. Ooh. Today, we're going to exercise a little bit. So today, I got the two contestants that's on the blind date blindfolded. And they have two objects in their head. Now, those objects will determine how the date is going. So if they like what the person's saying, the object stays down. And if they don't, well, you'll see what happens. Make sure so to tell a friend for tell a friend for tell our next friend. So back with our next video. Let's get into the video. Uh, yo, I'm Adam. I'm reaching out my arm to you to shake your hands. Jada. Jada. Oh, nice to meet you. Where are you from? I'm from Jamaica, obviously. Uh, I'm from Brooklyn. Brooklyn. All right, how many people are you guys currently talking to? <laughs> <laughs> I'm free. Two? Damn, that's like five. Whoa. Two. I said two. Yeah, two means five. Two don't mean five. Two means five. That's not proper math. <laughs> what would you guys say is your type? You want to go first? I'll go first. I don't mind. Dark skin. Preferably. <laughs> he got a guy. He has to have his shit together. Like you have to have a job that keeps you stable. I like tattoos. I'm not gonna lie. My type is nothing really physical. Just don't be into the astrology shit. That's it. And have his shit together, I guess. All right. What are your thoughts on blind dates? You go first. Well, I want to literally want a blind date. Can't see what. And ain't funny. So we'll see. Uh, I've never watched a blind date video, but I don't think I'm a fan of it because I don't like these surprises and shit. Why do you like surprises? Because I, I don't know who I'm talking to right now. That's the whole surprise. I don't like that. Why not? Uh-uh! That's a surprise. I can't hit him back? No! <laughs> Why? Yeah, you can. What, I can? Yeah. <laughs> Why so aggressive? Why so aggressive? Because I feel like you try to dodge it. I can sense it. I didn't dodge I it though. I, I, I took it like a man. So you're telling me if I swung towards your head, I, I took it like connected. a man. I ain't no bitch, bro. What are you talking okay, about? Okay, but next time we go see. All right. What's three pet peeves in a relationship? You want to go first? No, you go first. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I ain't been in a relationship so long. I can't remember. It. All right, but I'll go first. Then. Um, lack of communication, nonchalant, and um, you just can't like. You can't accept the fact that you're wrong sometimes. Like, how do I say it? I don't know how to explain it. But arguments, you always feel like you have to be right. You guys can't like come together and settle. Uh, friendly girls, I guess. Girls that believe everything they see in the media. I don't think I have much pet peeves, to be honest. <laughs> Next question. Describe yourself in three words from your last relationship. I was young, I was dumb, I wasn't broke, uh, I was broke too. I'm gonna say dumb is definitely one of them. Petty, but also naive. What are you petty for? There's no reason to be. Oh, I think that's a pet peeve for me. Petty? Yeah, don't be petty. Like... <laughs> Yo, why are you aiming at my head though? I didn't mean to aim at your head. Nah, you, t you, you told me you were gonna aim at my head. Though. But I didn't, did I? Yeah, you did. Oh, sorry. See, that's the pettiness I'm talking about, man. Jeez. All right, how do you guys feel about marriage? Good. I want to get married. I'm going to get married. Let me say that. I got to be married to the mother of my kids. Um, I'm waiting for that, you know? I, one day, eventually in the future. But I'm not mm, pushing for it right now. Question, y'all dreamt about your marriage before? Like, you plan color, who you're going to buy, all those shit. Cake size, cake color. Have I dreamt about it before? You know, like, plan. Yeah, I have. And that one sells. What's his color scheme? My color scheme? Yeah. Okay, one of them, I wanted like, uh, how do I explain it? Like champagne. One of them? Yeah. There's two different color schemes. Yeah, two different colors. Two different marriage. One of them. <laughs> <laughs> I should slap you for that. I, I should hit you for you that. You said one of the other. Uh, you said one of You the, acted like I'm playing two different weddings with two different people. No, no, I can plan my weddings with myself and what I want. Yeah, what are you so aggressive though? Like Why have I done to you? You don't even that know what I look like. That sounds factual. You don't even know what I look like. What do I gotta do with anything? Oh, you mad aggressive with me. You, you swing, you swing at me too. One, I'm aggressive in general. Oh, Ask them too. Alright, if you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? See, I, don't, I like myself. I'm, I, I would love to think God made me this image, so I ain't changing shit. Where you at? I'm right here. 
That's a red flag right there. Why is that a red flag? There's nothing to change. There's nothing you would change. I'm I'm in God's image. What's there to change? To be honest, I'm gonna be completely honest. I would change how hard I work. I feel like I dedicate myself to work too much. Like I will be at work for two weeks straight. I work for well, not two weeks. Ah, uh, that's I ain't gonna do that. <laughs> that's different. You know? I'm You're a, not I'm, ambitious. I should. How's, how's that not ambitious? I know my limits. Next quote. Just hit me for that. Next no, question. I didn't hit you. Well, uh, maybe it did. I didn't feel it. Do you guys believe in love at first sight? No. no. Damn. <laughs> Where's the weirdest place you've ever had sex? I don't need my host. In a pool? That's, that's not weird. I don't, I, I yeah, don't me. think I've had any weird places. Yeah. Under a house? <laughs> it's getting dirty. Do you have any fetishes? Uh, no. No. So. The next question is, what's going through your head or your heads right now? I'm waiting on her to fuck up so I can swing back. I'm waiting for you to fuck up so I can slap the shit out of you. But you've this. been slapping the shit out of me. What and I'm gonna continue. You? You've been slapping for no reason to. Uh uh. No, that's not true. That's that's the Brooklyn in you though. It seems about right. Uh, what's going through my head? I want to go to sleep. To be honest. That's what's going through my head. Damn, I'm, I'm putting her to sleep. I'm no, bored. oh my god, Damn. I've been you up see, all see, day. You see, this is our first date, and she just won't go to sleep. That's <laughs> crazy. Yo, focus on yourself, Kings. Yes, as you should. I'm gonna tell you the truth. Focus <laughs> on yourself. When do you most feel passionate? When I count money. Uh, when the direct deposit hits, bro. <laughs> when I'm working. But I'm saying when I'm working because I know I have the potential to grow in my position. So I'm passionate about my job. It's not just money. But, man, you think you're too deep. Alright, next question is what's, what's an ideal relationship to you? I don't think nothing's ideal. We just compromise, accept each other's flaws, help work towards it, you know, type shit. Um, I don't think I have an ideal relationship in mind. Go ahead and hit me. Yeah. <laughs> I really don't. Man. Really don't. You don't, you don't think you have an ideal relationship? No, I don't have an ideal relationship in mind because anything could happen at this point. B-F-F-R. What did that spell? Be fucking for real. Have you ever dated or messed around with the same sex? If so, how was your experience? No. Dog. What the blue clad this? I want this. Can I question that you? Can I, hey. But he didn't answer. All right, if you, guys, if you guys were supposed to make one assumption based on hearing each other's voice, what would you say? Aggressive. That's not an assumption. I told you that already. No, I, I, I'm assumed that from the first swing. I feel like you're light-skinned. <laughs> I'm going to tell you the truth right now. I feel like you're light-skinned. I'm the darkest nigga in the room. Though. Are you sure? Yeah. Okay. I think maybe Excuse you're light-skinned. You be light-skinned? I don't really I'm like light skin. I don't really like light skin, so I don't know. That's fine by me. But they be they be cocky as shit. Nobody's cocky. I'm just saying that's fine by me. If you don't like me, you don't like me. I say I don't like I say I don't like light skins. Okay. Is cheating a deal breaker? Yes. Depends how you cheat. No, I big on serious like fun on jokes. <laughs> How is that toxic though? You said it depends on how you cheat. Like cheating is cheating regardless of the situation. It should not be done. Alright, so you find you find somebody you uh, know. So break up. Nah, I we ain't going away that easy. Like it depends on what you do. Suck a nigga dick, man, you gotta go. I ain't gonna lie. So like that that's this is Keep like, talking. So if I'm texting somebody and I go on a date with somebody, but I'm in a relationship with you, it's okay. But let me. Go it's not okay, here. but it's, I'm not gonna be like, yo, we're over just cause you texting on a nigga. It's okay, it's dick. No, I'm gone. <laughs> no, <laughs> like that's that's disrespectful. So if I kiss somebody else, I enjoy. I don't know. Fuck. I'm not gonna break that's up with. Toxic. I'm not gonna break up with you cause you kiss on a nigga. Fuck. That's cheating. So his dick gonna leave, but why is that the one because thing that will make somebody leave? All right, so if me and him fuck, we staying together still? How long were we together? <laughs> I mean, okay. no, I'm I'm being dead ass though. Like we grown ups now, we're not in high school. Like if fuck a nigga in high school, we over. But we grown ass people. Like if we in three year relationship, we made plans, we've done shit already. You meet my parents, nigga. Nah. What that shit to do with me? Bro. You fuck somebody, you gone. You wanna fuck on somebody else? Continue. I don't wanna fuck on you no more. 
What's y'all thoughts on going 50-50 in a relationship? That's fine by me. My pra- I, I, I'm very prideful, though. It depends on what you want to go 50-50 with. I'm most likely, I'll, I'll prefer 80-20. That's also fine by me. <laughs> <laughs> um, next question is, is love enough to sustain a relationship? Maybe no. anything more that's still enough. No. It's enough to compromise, I'd say that. And if everyone's putting in effort with love, who knows? I don't know. Because if you sit there and you're like, oh, I love you, I love you, but you can't get your shit together, like I'm working my ass off, you want to sit on the but couch. But saying I love you isn't love, though. Okay, you're so in love with me. Why can't you get your shit together? If I'm in love with you, I'm going to compromise. Like, you don't like me doing that, I'm not going to do it. That boy is spitting. That's fair. I'm, I'm gonna give him that one. Don't hit me. Oh, uh, when was the last time you guys had intercourse? <laughs> <laughs> you could go first. Nah, I'll, I'll, I'll let you go first. No, go first. Nah, it's a I already person. said it. Ladies before gentlemen, love. I'm, I told you, I'm proud for. Go first. I have a lot of pride too, so I guess we're gonna sit in silence, huh? <laughs> I ain't even gonna go lie. It's been a minute. What can I just send this fuck out of? Uh, I'm mean, a bored man in a dog. They go, I'm gonna embarrass myself. It's been a minute. Um, I can play the, I can take a hit or play the fifth or something. No, oh, you're good. You won't get hit. I think it was like a week, a week ago. How about a week ago? Okay. Uh, how do you guys feel about experimenting in the bedroom? In what way? <laughs> yo, you're not gonna go near my ass, you know. I'm not gonna go near nobody ass. So, yo, uh -huh. <laughs> pretty simple. I the same answer as him, basically. So y'all would do anything but ass? Yeah, I don't do that stuff. Would y'all use toys like... Yeah. BDSM? Maybe. Media what? <laughs> BDSM. Like, bondage. Oh. Tire up. Yeah. In that case, yeah. Alright. What's your, what's your guys' thoughts on a prenup? I'm fine with it. I would get a prenup. Yeah, I'm, I'm alright. That's alright. It's fair. Alright. So based on all these answers, I need you to describe the person you're talking to with three words. Aggressive. Ain't no wrong with being aggressive, ladies. Just saying. You get me? Yo, you first, though. I don't know. You know something? thinking you go so light skinned, cocky, pulling yourself. But... Who, me? No, I thought you go say that about me. Nah, I'm the darkest nigga in the room. I was trying to be right. I mean, not right. Nice, but. Ah. No, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to say that about you. That's not true. You seem like a gentleman. I'm not going to push it and say that you are. You seem like one. I mean, um, if it sounds, if it looks like a duck, sounds like a duck. But you could be putting on a show right now. I am. Uh, if I was an actor, bro, I wouldn't be right here. Nah, fun, fun jokes aside, you're pretty chill. You just love to hit niggas for what, like. But I, well, I want to ask a question though. Go ahead. Why you entertain no two niggas? <clears throat> Damn. See, I wasn't, I wasn't expecting for it to happen. Word. It's not like I was like, oh my god, two people. So, it can move from two to three? It can move from two to three. Where? Yeah, you got a problem then. Okay. So you say dark skin, tats, that's that's two checks already, right? Yeah. Um, alright, last one. <laughs> <laughs> Describe your perfect date. I would say something like interactive. I don't want to fucking go on a date and we're just like sitting down watching a movie or nothing. Like, uh, let's go to a carnival. Let's go to fucking, what, what's it called? Slate? Something interactive, where we get to know you. Yo, as long as two we are off, dog, and we enjoy yourself, no matter what we are. Could I be moving up around with move here? What's the real reason why you're single? Or, um, me, I uh, travel a lot, I migrate a lot, so. And where I'm at right now, I think that's gonna be a permanent place for me. And my type ain't there, bro. Where I'm at is super, Super snowy, you get me? <laughs> I can't, I can't bring that around my mom. <laughs> my. She cheat on her man. Actually, you can relax yourself because I, like I said before, I don't do cheating. I don't condone cheating. And he fucked up. What, what do you call, what do you call fuck up? All right. What do I call fucked up? I gave him a chance with something very, 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 oh, fuck, fuck it. I'm gonna just say, I was engaged at one point and he fucked up bad. And he started treating me like shit and I was like, yeah, not bro. If you think putting a ring on somebody's finger gets to change how you act. Oh, you were engaged? Yeah, bro. That shit is crazy. So how long you were talking before the engagement? We were together for four years. Oh, so you take it. You're not single, bro. You've been delusional for four years? Hey. I'm trying to see what that feels like. Who's delusional? And I just said I'm not in that relationship no more, right? 
nobody is tanking. And to sit there and call me delusional is out of line. I'm playing, I'm playing. It's for the video. You need help getting up? <laughs> <laughs> See this? See how we work together? <laughs> See, we could have started a date like that, like with each other. That's good. Alright, this is the import. So I'm gonna count the three. Y'all gonna take the bond photos up. If you don't check those boxes like you said you do. <laughs> <laughs> Why you sat here and lied? You the darkest one in the room. <laughs> now I need you guys to point out three attractive things about each other. I don't do this. I'm so serious. You can ask that I'm not a mushy person. I don't do that. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Why are you just staring at me like this? I like tuts. I like tuts. I like your person swing it. Thank you. Um, I like locks, so. Word. At least you could dress, that I can say. I can't really, he, he, he put a fit on. <laughs> That's not getting today, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yo, teeth, good eye teeth. Yeah, I love that. I like your teeth. I like your teeth. You go, you go, you go. Thank you, thank you. Um, and you're actually nice. You're actually Would you guys go on another date? Like, would you guys go on an actual date? Is there a part two? Yeah. Oh, I will. Hey! 